Hey guys, Penguins Recordings here, and today I'm going to be showcasing some Stunt Rally 2.0 gameplay on Ubuntu 13.04. Now this is a free and open source game. Uh, the 2.0 version was released last month, I think May 6th, sometime around then. So I am going to be showcasing this game running in full graphics, hopefully. So under effects we have effects enabled, bloom is enabled, motion blur, SSAO, soft particles, depth of field, and god rays are enabled. HDR bloom, it's all there. Running at 1920 by 1080p, VSync is enabled. There is no anti-aliasing, whether I move it or not, there's no difference. Full screen is on. Alright, let's actually get into the game. Now as of it as current at at the current moment, there is no AI. You can only play with a friend on multiplayer. So when you're playing in this champion or single race, you will be alone and you'll be going against time only. So if we go into the championship mode, I'm going to choose a car. I am going to go with this guy. Nope, not this guy. This guy. I'm going to give him a greenish color. See, this player two and three, there aren't exactly any AI gamers... AI units in the game when you actually play it. There's a whole lot of things you can set in this game, no joke. Number of laps to road wall full collision and keep those at the current moment. These are my previous racings, previous tries. Alright, let's actually get into the game. Championship, I'm gonna go with Mountain Adventure. I'm gonna click start. Now when you're in the game, you can always look at the top left corner of the game to see the frames per second that I'm getting. Now with the screen recorder on, it's very heavy. This game on average gets around 30 frames per second. Then with the screen recorder, I only get about half. So it's probably going to lag quite a bit with the full graphics on. Not to mention that the controls are also extremely sensitive. So it's very likely I'm going to do a lot of crashing. I have to be very careful and take it slow. Definitely a nice looking map, that's for sure. Oh, I really wish I could fix the controls. I have to touch the keyboard so carefully so as not to go out of. Out of. Oh, 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 oh. Starting to do it already. It decides, hey, I don't want to listen to you anymore. I just want to go my own way. Oh, crash. So the first part of this video will be full screen gameplay just to see what it looks like and then we'll go into windowed mode and I am trashing this car let's change the views pressing X allows me to change the views well, this is a pretty cool view but it's also oh oh my goodness oh look at that that's not a very good view I can see through the mountain this car definitely looks very nice though I've never raced the car by controlling it from the side view this is weird oh trash it Crash it some more. Oh. Yeah, let's try this. Closer view. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at that. I'm on the inside. Oh, the inside looks kind of ugly. That's for sure. Look at the lighting effects. It's very nice. Just the controls are really frustrating. I've already set this the sensitivity all the way down but still it's acting like a nut job like this I'm gonna fall no oh my god oh my goodness oh my goodness I died I died and I lost that round okay let's change to a different place let's see what else we've got requires lots of steering I'm probably not gonna like that place at all the most circular tracks nope Insane stunts. Okay, let's try this. Oh, I'll change my car as well. Let's go through different car types. This one looks funky. Oh, it doesn't seem to f follow the color hues. Never mind. I guess it's not coloring the car. It's just the name of the player. Championship. Let's start it out. Frames per second is definitely very bad, though. I really hope they fix that. It needs to be optimized a lot more. Extreme! Long crazy track with loops, pipes, circular bridge turns, and small jumps. 
Okay, I gotta change my camera view. X, X again. Alright. Whoa. Oh, this car is not so bad. The controls are actually different for this car. Okay, maybe not so much. I was fooling myself. Oh, if I was playing this with a friend, it would probably be fun. Except for the controls. The controls are so hard. They should really make a game mode in this game where your main objective is just to crash into things and get points. Considering the controls of this game are very suitable for such a thing. Oh, jump. Nice. Oh, 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 let's go up, let's go up there. Make the jump, make the jump. Ooh, and I made it. Oh, I made it very badly. Oh my goodness. I think I'm starting to get the hang of controlling the cars in this game. So after this map, I am going to go into some windowed mode gameplay. Oh my god, I'm blind. Are we in the tunnel? Sweet. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my god, I'm gonna fall out. No, 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 no! Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Still a solid 17 frames per second, but I am doomed. There's no way I'm gonna get back to there. Okay, let's take a look at the different views this car can give, give us. Oh, that is pretty cool. I don't know why I like the look of this so much. Oh goodness, we didn't fall off. Made the turn. Oh. Reverse. All right. Let's try a different view. Well, this is a pretty nice view too. They really need to make a game mode where all your your only objective is to hit things. Look at that. It's like a safari ride. This looks pretty nice. Oh, when you turn around, then the rays suddenly disappear. When you look back, the rays appear again. Yeah, there we are. That's the rays right there. So it looks like the rays only come from one direction. This is the inside of the car. What the hell happened to the steering wheel? In fact, what the heck happened to the windows as well? Something's wrong. Okay. Changing views. Let's go back to the original view. Wow, so many camera views. I'm impressed. Alright, let's go into windowed mode gameplay. Alright, continuing the video in windowed mode, we have it set to 1680 by 1050. Full screen is disabled. I'm going to disable VSync. Now I'll leave it on for now. Although the frames will definitely drop quite a bit. Let's go back. Let's go into championship. Let's try a couple more, well, maybe one more map. See, jungle. Jungle scenery looks good. I'm going to choose a different car as well this time. What do we have? This car looks pretty cool. Choose random. I don't actually know if it affects the color or not in the end. Alright, so we have the car selected. Championship will be jungle scenery. Windowed mode gameplay with everything maxed out. Wow, immediately already it looks so cool. I'm gonna click start. Oh, my camera angle is very peculiar. Change that. Oh my goodness, I think my car might be a bit too glossy. Way too glossy. What the heck? It looks like a freaking mirror. Okay, let's see if I can actually do this. Frames per second are definitely a lot better. 25 frames per second in windows mode as compared to full screen which we were getting about 17, 18 could also be the map wow this map looks pretty sweet wow even the ground has like these bumps bump mapping okay that's like a yeah side view angle whoa I don't know why I like this angle so much it looks so cool like in the movies
Oh my goodness. Wow, even the mud has effects. Okay, this is a pretty cool map. Change the view. Pressing X to change the view. Relatively easy. Looks like they paid a lot of attention to this map. Oh, if it just had AI, that would be so much fun. Now, is it just me or does this cause to have a lot better control? Maybe different cars have different controls? I don't know. Oh, it's so ugly on the inside. <laughs> it's so ugly on the inside. Oh, I didn't pass because I wasn't focusing. Alright, gonna go click back. Let's try one more place because that was pretty fast. That was a really beautiful place too. Mud and water fan. Now, this sounds interesting. Let's choose a different car as well this time. We'll choose this old school. I think this is a BMW. Is it? I think so. Random color. Glossiness is pretty high. Alright, let's give it a go. Oh, so ugly on the inside of the car. Click X to change the view again. Change it again. Change it again. And again. Alright. Oh, okay, I'll try it racing from like this. This gives it like an RC car feel. Oh, there you go. You can actually drive inside water. <laughs> oh, this camera angle is not so good. Why isn't the camera angle turning? Oh my goodness. How the hell am I supposed to know where I'm going? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, okay, I need to change the camera. Oh, okay, this is a better camera angle. There we go. This is a pretty nice looking map as well. I'm not trying to drift, but he's drifting regardless. You stupid dude! The hell, man? Are you drunk? Oh my god. Okay, there we go. I wanted to drift, and I did. Oh, I did not want to drift there. I am underwater! <laughs> okay, let's get a closer view. Side view, please. There we go. Yeah, action packed. Oh, oh, I hit that. Man, this side view is pretty cool. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Out of control. Maybe this game was built to be with those specific car driving controllers. I have no idea. Oh, I'm going through the tunnel. Oh yes, fun, fun, fun. Awesome. Oh, oops, wrong way. Reverse, yep. Oh my god. <laughs> Just press W and you can re... What is it, flips the car. I can imagine playing with a friend is probably a lot of fun. Hitting each other. Racing against time. There really needs to be a game mode where you just crash into things. This feels so perfect for that. I've definitely lost this one. Oh, 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 sit up, sit. Oh my god, I made it. Oh, and I crashed. Crashed to that. Oh, and I'm crashing into that again. Oh, oh, inside of the water. Did you see that? Okay, I think I'm losing track of time here. I'm just playing this. Did I lose already? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I did not pass the stage. <laughs> the controls are too darn hard. But the game looks absolutely amazing. Definitely needs anti-aliasing for sure. And there are peculiarities like the inside of the car looks pretty ugly. If they fix the controls and they add AI players, I think this game would be a, a keeper for sure. Heck, if they added a game mode where you just crash into things, that would be fun enough. So that's it for this video game. Uh, <laughs> I can't even speak properly. That's it for this gameplay video, guys. I hope you enjoyed watching and thanks for watching.